An issue many users face with Apple M1 machines is that it only supports up to two displays. This limitation can provide huge sacrifices within your workflow. In this video, we will take a look at using Apple Sidecar with my M1 iPad Pro and how to connect a normal secondary display to your iMac, creating a triple monitor setup. First, let's take a look at a very simple dual screen monitor setup. If you own any compatible iPad running at least iPadOS 13, you will have the option to utilize Sidecar. You simply connect your iPad to your iMac inside of system preferences, and within seconds, you are connected, having a completely wireless display with little to no latency of which is noticeable. Now, if you don't want to use Apple Sidecar and you want to connect a full-size monitor, you are going to need an external dock. As the new M1 iMac does not have a HDMI or mini display port connection like previous generations, we have to add one ourselves. To achieve this, I am using the OWC Thunderbolt 3 dock. Not only is this great for adding additional USB ports and SD card slots, but it also provides a mini display port connection, letting me connect this 1440p ultra wide display to my M1 iMac. If you're looking to save money and you don't require the additional functionality that a dock like this provides, a simple display adapter can achieve the same results. Another important thing to be aware of, if you are connecting a display with a resolution greater than 1080p, you need to check the specifications of the cable you are purchasing. A lot of the cheaper cables available on Amazon only output at a maximum resolution of 1920 by 1080p. So make sure that your mini display port cable can support up to 4K or whatever you require if you're connecting a high resolution display. I will link the mini display port cable I've been using with my ultra wide monitor in the description if you wish to check that out. Now there are a few things you can do to optimize your multi-screen workflow with your M1 iMac. When using Sidecar, if you don't want all of these menu bars to be displayed on your iPad, you can turn these off within the Sidecar preferences. Additionally, if you want to relocate them, you can do that too. When working with three monitors, it is important that the iMac knows the order and position of those monitors on your desk. If you go to displays inside of system preferences, click on arrangement. Here, you can click and drag your displays to replicate their configuration making it much easier to work between the displays without any frustrations. So we have now created a triple screen monitor setup with the M1 iMac. Our primary monitor is the provided 4.5K Retina display built into the iMac. Our second screen is the ultra wide monitor. And for our third screen, I am using my M1 iPad Pro via the sidecar feature available on Mac. If you enjoyed this video, drop it a like and also subscribe to catch new videos every single week.